Okay, so we're gonna get sorted into our houses because uh, Wynn's a fucking nerd. We go to Hogwarts and then we come in Gryffindor. Okay, be sorted. Daniel, join your Hogwarts house. Find you, find out. Okay, all right, forest or river? I don't know, probably forest. It's pretty, trees, you know, nature -y. Plus I don't like getting wet, so forest, boop. All right. Forest or river? The forest, lots of trees, very calming. I am not centered. Hey, there we go. All right, forest. Forest is good. Moon or stars? Um, I mean, stars, probably. Oh, I like the constellations. I like how much story is in the stars. I think that's really cool. Just like the history of humanity talking about you know, telling stories with random dots in the sky is kind of cool, so, stars. What kind of instrument most pleases your ear? The violin, the trumpet, the piano, or the drum? Like, pleasing, definitely violin. Just, it's so pretty. Just, I don't know. It's just like a lovely, soulful instrument. Or it can be, you know, like gross and country, but I, when played correctly, <laughs> it can be really nice. So violin, boop. What kind of instrument pleases your ear? Pleases your ear. Very elegant. Violin, trumpet, piano, drum. Mm, I don't know. I have not listened to much music uh, in the real world. <laughs> not my world. Uh, I will say trumpet. I would say trumpet, it's very passionate, very bright. It's a very bright instrument. Given the choice, would you rather invent a potion that would guarantee you love, glory, wisdom, power? Okay, so I'm not a glory power guy. Um, I don't really like the pressure that comes with that. So wisdom, probably not looking for love. So by process of elimination, I'm probably gonna be a Ravenclaw. <laughs> okay. How would you like to be known to history? Uh, Kit the Wise? Kit the Good? <laughs> no. Kit the Great? Kit the Bold? Probably the Bold. That feels most badass to me. Like, I could be great, but still be like, you know, a loser. So I'm gonna be bold. Given the choice, would you rather Invent a potion that would guarantee you love. Oh, love. There is nothing more important than love. I'm going to say, uh, I should probably look at the rest. Love, glory, wisdom, power, love. Nothing, nothing is more important than love. If you were attending Hogwarts, which pet would you choose to take with you? Tabby cat, Siamese cat, ginger cat, lots of cats, ginger cat. I've got a ginger cat and I like her a lot. Um, so I'll just take her, can I just take her? Luna, you're coming with me to Hogwarts. Would you rather be envied? Probably. In imitated. Imitation is the uh, best flattery. Trusted, probably a good thing to be. Praised, yes. Liked, duh. Feared, no, that's the only one that I thought, oh, this is, this is hard. Liked, praised. I feel like praised goes with like trusted. Oh, well, maybe you can like trust someone to be a shithole. But you know, like praised and imitated, look up to, like generally that means you're liked. Probably not envied. Like I like making other people feel good. Like I don't wanna like rub any of my awesomeness in people's faces and be like, I'm better than you. Imitated, I like to be my own person. So probably not that. Trusted, praised. Like, I am a trustworthy person, but honestly, I give me give me that lip service. I want to be praised. Tell me nice things. Say nice things about me. You and two friends need to cross a bridge guarded by a river troll who insists on fighting one of you before he will let you all pass. Do you attempt to confuse the troll into letting all three of you pass without fighting? That's not very Gryffindor, but that is very me. <laughs> suggest, drawing, uh, suggest drawing lots to decide which of you will fight. No. Suggest all three of you should fight without telling the troll. Maybe, maybe. Volunteer to fight. 
I do not like fighting. I do not like fighting. Uh, I, we will confuse the troll. I will outsmart the troll. What are you most looking forward to learning at Hogwarts? I'm gonna be... They're setting me up for Ravenclaw. I'm calling it right now. Okay, apparition and disapparition. Transfiguration. Flying on a broomstick, that'd be cool. Hexes and jinxes. Caring about magical creatures, how to befriend them. Ah, uh, okay, probably. Secrets about the castle. Every area of magic I can. Oh, that one's tough. You know, I probably don't want to spread myself too thin, right? No, I totally do. If I got into a magical world, it would be all about learning. It just everything. Like, I would be freaking out. I would want to know all of it right away. <laughs> if you were attending Hogwarts, which pet would you choose to take with you? Tabby Cat? We already have one of those. Siamese Cat. Ginger Cat. Lots of cats. Black Cat. White Cat. Is there... Is it just cats? Oh, Tawny Owl, Screech Owl, Brown Owl, Snowy Owl, brown, Barn Owl, uh, Toad, Common Toad, Natterjack Toad, the fuck is that? Dragon Toad, that sounds fake. Harlequin Toad, she'd be too hooked up on the Joker, that wouldn't work out at all. Or Three Toad, Tree Toad. <laughs> Fuck, say that three times fast. I like that one's name. I'm just gonna choose that one because like, I don't know. Be like, what's that? Be like, oh, it's my three toad tea toad. I can't even shit. <laughs> it's my three toad tree toad. <laughs> and then I can watch other people try to say it and do it just as terribly as that. And then everybody laughs and we have, it'll be an icebreaker. Okay, three toad tree toad. <laughs> Next. Which would you rather be? Envied, imitated, trusted, praised, liked, feared, and we're back at envied. Um, trust, trust is important. Trust is important. Trust, you have, you know, between two people, if you have no trust, you have nothing, you have nothing. We trust each other. What kind of instrument most pleases your ear? The violin, the trumpet, piano, drum. I dig the piano. It's a versatile, uh, versatile instrument. Could do just about anything on a piano. A muggle confronts you and says that they are sure you're a witch or a wizard, and I tell them I'm a fairy, bitch. Um, do you ask what makes them think so? Agree and ask whether they'd like a free sample of a jinx? <laughs> that sounds naughty. <laughs> Agree and walk away, leaving them to wonder whether you're bluffing. Tell them that you're worried about their mental health and ask to call a doctor. Ooh. Okay, so I really like the snarky responses. I envision myself in this scenario just being like, yeah, probably, and walking away and having them be like, what the heck? So yeah, agree, walk away, leaving them to wonder whether I'm bluffing. What pet would I choose? Um, Tebby, Siamese. Oh, this one. This is the one with all the cats and all the owls. Yes, 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 yes. Ah, uh, toad. What's a dragon toad? What is that? All right. Uh, do I want a cat? Do I want an owl? Do I want a toad? I think an owl. An owl has it's uh, it's fierce, but it is very reserved, and it's they're very elegant. Very elegant creatures. Tawny owl too small. Screech owl too loud. Barn owl. Barn owls. Barn owls are very pretty. We'll do barn owl. Yeah. A troll has gone berserk in the headmaster's study at Hogwarts. It is about to smash, crush, and tear several irreplaceable items and treasures. In which order would you rex- Good, good, okay. In which order would you rescue these objects from the trolls club if you could? This is a complex question. First, a nearly perfected cure for dragon pox. Then, student records going back 1,000 years. Finally, a mysterious handwritten book full of strange runes. First, uh, oh, so it's just those three things. I mean, the cure for dragon pox, obviously, because that's gonna come, I mean, that's gonna save lives. So that would be number one. Mysterious book, student records, uh, that's tough. 
Because I don't know what this book is. Is this like the only knowledge of these runes? Or is this just someone's like study notes? You know, we, you don't know. Probably the first one. Cure for Dragon Fox, Pox, uh, student records going back a thousand years. Cause like, you know, student records going back a thousand years. That is the history of this. God, I'm gonna be a Ravenclaw, I hate this. Which of the following would you most like to study? Centaurs, goblins, mer people. I don't like getting wet. Not a water person, not that one. Ghosts, vampires, werewolves, Trolls, no fucking fairies, are you kidding me? Come on, this is a mythical world. Where are the fairies? Okay, trolls are gross, werewolves are gross, vampires are stupid. I'm sorry, I'm offending so many people right now. Ghosts are okay. More people are in the water and I don't like that. Goblins are gross, centaurs are cool. I don't really like any of these. I'm gonna select centaurs by default, I guess, because they're kind of cool and I, if I remember correctly in the books they're like really pretentious fuckheads which I totally dig so yeah let's go with that which of the following would you like to centaurs centaurs very cool goblins no mer people little too scary we saw we saw shape of water he's a mer person yeah he uh terrifying <laughs> Don't, want, don't, wouldn't want to be around that. Ghosts, vampires, werewolves, trolls, centaurs, very elegant, very strong. We'll go with centaurs. You and two friends need to cross a bridge guarded by a river troll who insists on fighting one of you before he'll let you all pass. Do you attempt to confuse the troll without, uh, into letting all three of you pass without fighting? Suggest drawing lots. Suggest all three of you fight without telling the troll. Volunteer. Honestly, I'm gonna, I'd volunteer to fight. I'd lose, but I don't, I don't want my friends to get hurt. Come on. Okay, black or white? I mean, like, are we talking about, like, what are we wearing? Like, decor? Like, what, I don't know, prob prob probably white. It, you can, you can do more with it. You know, you put color on a black wall and there's nothing. You put color on a white wall and you can make... White is more inviting. There's more opportunities with a, you know, a white canvas. I, I don't fucking... <laughs> These questions are silly. <laughs> oh, I'm a Gryffindor. Okay. That's the good house, right? Like, that's the badass house. That's when Harry was in. I can dig it. All right, yeah, cool, I'm a Gryffindor. Left or right? I'm right-handed. We'll say right. Say right. Ha ha, I tell you, I tell you I'm a Gryffindor. I am a Gryffindor, I know myself. I don't need a computer to tell me about myself. I know myself. I am Leto, I am Leto Rodriguez, and I am a lion. <laughs> Heads or tails? Is this like a, I'm tossed between two, two houses and they're making me choose? <laughs> Um, heads. We'll just see what comes first. All right. I called it. Did I not? Did I not? Did it? Thank you. Called it from the first moment. I'm a Ravenclaw. Cool beans. All right. So I'm done now, I guess. Um, bye. Rawr. I'm a lion. Rawr. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Bye. <laughs>